Hey guys, so I thought I'd do something a little bit different at the weekend going forwards. I want to start doing vlog content alongside the gaming content. The reason for this is that the gaming content takes quite a long time to film and then edit down to something that's quite choppy and fun and interesting to watch. So these videos should hopefully take a little bit less time for me, but it also means that you have more video content which you guys have been asking for on my channel. Um, so a few things first before I go on to my video today which is going to be showing you my setup. Um, first of all to say thank you for this amazing fan art that I received. I'm going to drop a link below if you want to check out the artist's Instagram page. The second thing is to say hello to my new subscribers. Um, I know where you guys have come from and I really appreciate it. So thank you so much and I hope that you enjoy the content on my channel. So my video today is going to be my gaming setup. I like to think of my setup as inspirational. Um, and the reason for that is because it, it's kind of hilariously bad. It's the exact example of how, if you ever look at somebody who makes videos on YouTube in gaming that does well, mine's like the polar opposite. So mine's everything that you shouldn't do, but that's how I've been making my videos. So it should be kind of quite inspirational for people who want to make this, but don't have a really big desk and loads of screens. So, to be fair, in my case, even a normal sized desk. So first of all, the first thing you'll notice is that my desk is absolutely tiny. The reason for that is that I did go to buy um, a normal sized desk and I saw this one, I think it was about 30 quid. So I was like, oh wow, that's so cheap, that's amazing. Didn't look at the dimensions, got it home and realised that I basically bought a small child's school desk. But <laughs> I can't really get another desk at the moment, one because this room's not huge, but two because I just don't have the cash to buy another one. So I'm stuck with this hilariously bad, tiny, tiny desk that I have bruises all over my legs from because I keep kneeing the desk every time I get up and out of the chair. This is the screen that I use, it's a Benq, 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 however you pronounce it. Uh, it's a Benq screen, Benq, this sounds wrong. Uh, the reason I got this screen is because it has a really small bevel around the sides which means it looks super big when you are playing. I think on a normal sized desk it would be perfect, however on my like tiny person's desk it means that the screen does feel really close to my face, which is kind of annoying. But again, that's totally my own fault. So my keyboard and mouse are the same keyboard and mouse I used at my parents' house, probably when I was about 13, 14. So this mouse is like 10 years old, really. It's an old keyboard and mouse. It's really gross looking. They don't even work very well anymore, but they get the job done for now. My aim is to save up and buy a really nice gaming keyboard and mouse, maybe like a Razer one or one that has the cool backlit keys. But for now, I'm stuck with the technology from the 90s. Oh wait, that's not 10 years ago. Technology from the early 2000s. So moving on, uh, my computer, which is the newest thing that I've got here. I really love my PC. It's still fairly new to me. The specs are the super highest end of PC, but they let me run Skyrim on Ultra, they let me run Skyrim with kind of 80 to 90 mods, so it does the job for what I need it to do. I've got a Blue Snowball microphone, which I actually find doesn't pick up my audio very well, but I can't have it too close to me because I scream a lot. I think if I was holding it really close to my face, it would be fine and it would pick up the audio really well, but because I'm quite loud and then quiet and then loud, it does struggle a little bit to pick up the extreme decibels of when I scream. Um, I think only dogs can hear some of that anyway, and it tends to kill headphone users, so sorry about that guys. And then you can see I've got a Logitech webcam, which I think records up to 1080p, but it might be 720p. I don't even have gaming headphones, I have um, some just random idiot headphones. As you can see, I've got the 360 underneath the um, my teeny, tiny, tiny desk now. I did have a peer, uh, sorry, an Xbox One in my setup up until recently. I don't currently have access to an Xbox One at the moment, which is why I'm not recording any Outlast videos at the moment. Um, then I also have a PlayStation 4, but that's in the other room, and it's something I've not actually used for any videos yet. I do have uh, The Last of Us, uh, which I haven't played yet. I haven't played The Last of Us at all, so that is something that I may consider doing a Let's Play of, if it's something that you guys would be interested in watching. So, this is the first vlog I've done, hopefully you've enjoyed it and you find my setup absolutely laughable. Uh, leave a comment below and let me know what you think and hopefully it should have some more videos for you guys next week. Thank you!